subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to get latest updates from learnfordafford.com There are various objects around us they can be grouped in different ways based on properties such as size shape color or their use Watch ad free and complete syllabus on Learn for Tafat Android app. Download the app now. There is one more property with which we can classify objects. It is based on material from which the object is formed. A material is a thing such as wood, glass, plastic, cotton, metals, mud, paper. etc from which object can be formed in general any substance or mixture of substances which has mass and volume is called material we see different objects around us these are formed from different materials while classifying them we have to consider few things these are a single object is usually formed from different materials for example a bicycle is made of metal rubber and plastic a utensil is made of metal with the handle of wood or plastic a spectacle is made of plastic and glass However, a single object can also be formed from single material. For example, balloon is made of rubber, a toy is made of plastic, a towel is made of cotton. It is also important to note that a single material can be used to make different objects. For example, from wood we produce things such as tables, chairs, doors, wardrobes etc from cotton we produce things such as shirts pants bed sheets towels etc here is a table showing some of the materials and things produced from them so how can we classify objects Watch ad free and complete syllabus on Learn for Tafat Android app. Download the app now. Here are few things to classify. We will identify materials from which it is made. So, these are the things which are made of plastic. These are made of wood and these are the things which are made from combination of more than one material. To test your knowledge here is a question find the odd man out from the given example basketball eraser gloves tube bottle balloon the answer is bottle we use material called rubber for making all the things except bottle for bottle we use plastic or glass material Watch ad free and complete syllabus on Learn for Tafat Android app. Download the app now. For solving our need, we make objects. These objects are formed from materials. What will happen if you don't choose proper material for making the object? Definitely You don't want to be in such a situation. Watch ad free and complete syllabus on Learn for Tafat Android app. Download the app now. In order to make objects for specific need, we must understand the properties of materials. We will discuss these properties in this video. Appearance. 
It gives idea about the visual look of the material. If a material appears shiny, then we say that it have a property called luster. Usually, metals have luster. If you don't see luster on metal, try to rub the metal with sandpaper. You will see the metallic luster. Other materials did not have luster. If you touch some objects, they appear either smooth or rough. The roughness is due to bumps on the surface. Similarly, some objects are hard while others are soft. With the term hardness, we mean that the material does not allow to change its shape. It does not allow anything to go into it or scratch over it. It does not break easily. Watch ad free and complete syllabus on Learn Fatafat Android app. Download the app now. If a material changes its shape, allows scratching over it, or break easily, then such material is soft material. State Basically, materials exist in three states. Solid, liquid and gas. Those which have fixed shape and volume are solids. Those which have fixed volume but does not have fixed shape are liquids. And those which neither have fixed shape nor fixed volume are gases. Solubility When we mix some materials such as sugar, salt, lemon juice, vinegar, etc. in water, then they completely disappears in it. That is, they get completely dissolved in water. We say that material is soluble in water. Other materials such as sand, chalk powder, coconut oil, kerosene, etc. does not disappear in water and thus these are insoluble in water. Ability to float Some materials such as wood, plastic, rubber, etc. have ability to stay on the surface of water. We say that these materials can float on water. There are other materials such as metals, sand, stone, etc. which when dropped in water goes at the bottom. That means these materials does not float on water. Watch ad free and complete syllabus on Learn Fatafat Android app. Download the app now. Transparency Some materials such as glass, water, etc. allows us to look through them completely. Such materials are called transparent materials. Some materials such as wood, mud, sand, does not allow us to look through them. These are called opaque materials. There are some materials, for example, trace paper, oily paper, etc., which allows us to look through them only partially. Such materials are called translucent materials. Magnetic properties Some materials get attracted towards magnet. These are magnetic materials, for example, iron, nickel and cobalt. Others which does not get attracted towards magnet are non-magnetic material, for example, plastic, wood, paper, glass, etc. Conduction of heat Some materials allow heat to flow through them, for example, all metals, are good conductors of heat. Other materials which does not allow heat to pass through them are bad conductors, that is, insulators of heat. For example, wood, 
प्लास्टिक कॉटन ग्लास एक्सेट्रा वॉच एड फ्री एंड कंप्लीट सिलेबस ऑन लर्न फटाफट एंड्रॉइड ऐप डाउनलोड दी ऐप नाउ electricity some materials allow electricity to pass through them these are called conductors for example all metals salt solution etc other materials which does not allow electricity to pass through them are insulators for example wood plastic glass cotton oil distilled water etc we can use any property to classify the material for example here are some materials and we need to classify them according to electrical conduction can we do that yes the answer is like this I hope you have understood this topic very well. Thanks for watching this video. For more videos, log on to learnfortafford.com and get your favorite course the way you want. Like, share and subscribe learnfortafford.com and press the bell icon to never miss an updates from learnfortafford.com.